Hello Collective, welcome back to the Ascended Divination Priestess channel. You are greatly appreciated. I am sending you all lots of love, joy, peace, and happiness. Many, many blessings to you and your families as always. I return to source, I return to sender, all negative energies and intent immediately and permanently. I call in only the purest of white light and pray that you stay only in the highest of vibrational energies. Whatever the enemy has stolen from you, is trying to steal from you, it is returned to you, being returned to you. As we speak, all evil and negative intent of the enemies against you are dismantled, being dismantled as we speak. As I have said, so shall it be. Judgment is final. Let's go ahead and get into our tarot reading. We have a family here that is working extremely hard to take someone's abundance. Um, they're work, working. These people, I don't know what it is about the this group that keeps coming up consistently in every reading. The truth is out about some type of inheritance. There's a woman of high honor that stole someone's abundance or tried to steal someone's abundance, spiritual abundance, financial abundance, something that was left to you. A sister don't got out here and stole it or a family got out here and stole it was paying people. This is clarity for someone. Was paying people or has been paying people behind the scenes to keep their mouth shut. Meanwhile, working on some type of court case or have you blocked, have you trapped, binded into something that has nothing to do with you. She may be working with a King of Pentacles right now. I've been picking up on a couple of King of Pentacles behind the scenes that have been working with this family, this group, this woman. They're going through some type of disappointment, distress, maybe throwing a fit because something is not working in their favor. This is, you know, this is not one person going through this as far as, as, far as in the light working community, okay? <coughs> there is a karmic group for each and every one of you. And they're all kind of mirroring themselves, uh, mirroring each other because it's like in every reading, they're all doing the same thing. The reading keeps coming out the same way. They're out here committing frauds, fortune people's signatures, trying to set people up, uh, all types of stuff you can think of. You have people in companies that are hired just for the sake of blocking you, uh, invading your privacy. Some of you, your bosses are involved, your fathers, your uncles, husbands, uh, people's just people you probably don't even know are involved in this. You may not know because your ancestors in the universe are protecting you. So you may have a queen, uh, um, someone of high honor and a king of pentacles that may be going through some type of distress. There's some type of conflict going on behind the scenes about an empress energy uh, being seen as someone that's genuine, someone that is uh, healing, someone that will be having their new beginning. I don't know what this is, but it's been a lot of manipulation going on. They've been plotting on how to take you out, how to set you up. But this group is going through karma. Today, the word is karma. Okay, folks, let's say it together, karmics. Karma, you're going through karma, okay, because of the decisions you made. There is the truth being illuminated. People don't want it coming out, so they're out here blocking, blocking people's nine to five, people, uh, people's opportunities, people's platforms, playing with numbers, all kinds of stuff. If you look on my on my channel, sometimes uh, videos are disappearing because people don't want the truth coming out. Whatever it is they've been doing, it didn't lead to nothing but disappointment because the truth is still coming out. These people are facing blockages and things like that. Uh, outbursts, having outbursts behind the scenes because there's some type of plan to take you out that is at a standstill. They don't know what to do because the universe is in here balancing things out. Um, as you can see, they may have been trying to stop someone from healing, elevating, ascending, but he's still doing it. This could be someone coming after a King of Cups, been causing a lot of illusions. On the other hand, it could be a King of Cups that's been causing a lot of illusions as well. It's just like something is being balanced out and these people are refusing to accept the situation for what it is. For some of you, yeah, there's a King of Cups here going through karma. He's losing everything. He's been working so hard to end someone else's abundance and look at him stepping right into poverty. We told you, we warned you, I've been warned you, okay? You, you, you've been coming out repeatedly in these reads. You're headed right to poverty. Something you've been doing and trying to hide, you can't hide anymore. There's some type of legal case that's going to come up, some type of court case, either for defamation, slander, thievery, forgery, Something is going to come up. There could be someone trying to run away from this situation. Baby, I don't know where you're going, but it's too late. You're going to have to stay and eat your humble pie, uh, fish your karma. Because when you all were out here trying to destroy people's life, you didn't see us walking away. What happened? We stayed right there. 
and took it all, took it all in. He said, hmm. You know, when someone punches you and you got to stay strong, keep a straight face, but you really don't want to. Yeah, you still got to be the big guy, big girl in the room. You just act like, whoo, you just take one for the team. That's what you guys are going to have to do, okay? But there's a king of cups here. You're about to lose everything. You will be uh, terminated from a position. You are going to be losing everything. I've been predicted this like two, three months ago, and you guys didn't listen. You were still out here feeling invincible. You, you felt that because you had networked with other institutions, with other communities, You've you invaded people's uh, lives, their finances, their works, their platforms and things like that. And you were shutting things down, blocking things and all of that, that everything was going to go in your favor, that you were secure. And repeatedly, a lot of readers kept telling you it ain't going the way you think it is. So there's some type of karma playing out because two people are a company and someone will still be coming together to work together or whatever this is and the connection will be successful. Um, but there is a karmic group, person, couple, whatever behind the scenes that has been collecting, okay, collecting other businesses, institutions, people, just ne networking. I'm telling you, networking with people on how they can take something from someone else or keep something that they illegally got. So someone has access to the court system, the legal system. There may be lawyers and judges that don't mind forging documents because they're getting paid for it. But there are other uh, lawyers and judges in the court system that do things the right way. So this is what, what the blockage is for these people. The blockage is, is that there's someone in the court system or there's someone in the situation that's in the upright. So everything these people have been working to do is leading to nothing. You see, they're going from the... Ten of Pentacles, Eight of Pentacles, Five of Pentacles. Baby, we've been told you. We told you. Everything you stole. I've been tell, saying this on my platform. Do not take what you cannot afford to lose. Do not take what you do not want to lose. You more than likely try to take a Ten of Pentacles, Eight of Pentacles from someone and have them living in a Five of Pentacles. And that's exactly what the universe is giving you. Okay? Okay. So you may be trapped in an institution, trapped in some type of toxic situation. You're toxic and karmic as heck. Unhappy behind the scenes. Some, you, you've had... Something I'm picking up on is that there's a man out here or a woman. Could be either or because tarot energy is fluid. Mm-hmm. Instead of them being the one to watch people, they've been having young folks, family members, relatives, co-workers, their colleagues, uh, uh, partners in crimes, watching different readers and reporting back to them to see how things are going. Am I going to lose what I stole? Am I going to lose what I tried to steal? Am I going to lose what does not belong to me? Uh, yes, it's a big yes. You are losing it. You ain't getting it. Okay. All right. Uh, I don't know if you all have been trying to block a relationship or union. It's coming together. It's coming together. It's coming together. Okay. It's coming together. For someone out there, you may end up coming together with someone very high ranking in the court system. And they're going to be very protective of you. I've been seeing that coming out in my reading quite a lot. Uh, for another person, be cautious because there's a king of swords that may want to come towards you to give you some type of la da di 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 la di da di da story. You don't got time for that because he was part of this nonsense behind the scenes too when it came to betraying you stealing your abundance blocking your abundance blocking your forward movement not wanting you to take action and go for the things you want there's a woman of high high honor could be a queen of wands that's pissed off behind the scenes because they don't went from celebrating baby to want 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 it's the end these people martyred themselves we did tell them for a long time, don't do that, don't go there, don't say that, don't sign that, don't force their signature, don't file their false police report, don't lie, don't cheat, don't steal. Stop trying to set people up so that you can have them locked up, that, so that you can get what belongs to them. You didn't listen, now look at you. Look at you, just a toxic karmic stuck, stuck, stuck. You're stuck and you can't get out. What are you going to do? Someone is trying to flee this situation. You can't go anywhere. Wherever you're going is going to be worse for you. You may not even get there. You're going to get arrested on your way to your destination. Uh, sir, can you step out of the car, please? <laughs> can you step out the car, please? There's a king of pentacles out here losing his emotions. <laughs> he ain't balanced as heck. Someone's about to have an emotional outburst. Like, oh my gosh. You know, it's someone out here that's been pretending to be wholesome, 
very uh, uh, authoritative but calm and majestic and he ain't none of the above baby someone's about to spaz out depressed all kinds of stuff just having some type of emotional outburst i can't do this anymore this goddamn has to get on my nerves i don't lost access to this access to th oh baby he ain't happy behind the scenes he is not happy you see that three of swords and the Queen of Cups in the reverse. Someone is depressed behind the scenes. Oh, baby, depressed, depressed. Gotta go within and choose a different path. It's fighting and arguing, competition, everything you can think of. These people are coming up against you because of envy, jealousy. They want what belongs to you. Mind you, they didn't even put in two cents. Then work for nothing you got going on for yourself, but they're out here trying to take from people. And this is not just one person going through this. This is a whole lot of light workers going through this situation. These people, family, uh, spirit team, don't left them. They said, mm -mm -mm. we don't want to be part of that. We don't want to be a, a part of that. But it's the King of Pentacles behind the scenes going through some type of uh, depression. Very emotionally exhausted. We do not care. Someone may be passing away. Uh, this is someone with a girlfriend that he's been upkeeping at the detriment of you. So while you've been out here slaving, they've been living off of you. Getting that check every month or every week. All right, to live that la vita loca and keep you bonded, keep you stuck. Keep you in some type of distress. It's that she can get this, he can get this this little bit that's all they deserve mind you these are all greedy insecure and imbalanced people that don't even deserve what it is they have they've all stolen to get to where they are someone signed their life away to the devil now they're bonded to something they cannot get out of you're going to jail or you're going to be sued for something and you're going to lose everything did i say everything everything because whoever you all have been coming after baby they don't care what you got going on they don't care if you got an illness they don't care if you got a child that's sick a dog like that's sick grandma's sick grandpappy is sick mommy I, we don't care baby this new generation of light workers and high priestesses we got zero f-u-c-k-s to give okay we don't care so you're gonna have to figure that out just as joyly you were the joyly man okay you know how Santa Claus is jolly. You you were Santa Claus when you were signing your name. Baby, I'm telling you, you were Santa Claus when you were signing your name. Okay? After you signed your name, you walked away in confidence. You said, yes. Oh, my gosh, yes. Not knowing the whole time they were signing their life away to the devil. Now they're bonded, they're caught up in something they can't get out of. Wanted to come towards you to manipulate you. Talking about... I'm so sorry. I didn't know what was going on. I would like to work with you. I would like to invest in what it is you have going on. I have a lot of feelings for you. And you're looking at them like, feelings? Do you even have feelings? Because people that have feelings don't move the way you do. You're slimy. Okay? Someone's, someone behind the scene in this group is sick. Instead of them healing. Yeah, someone is sick. Instead of them healing, okay, they decided to get involved in something that they should not be involved in. Someone's about to go back home. They're under judgment. They're still trying to move forward in discipline to take you down. And it ain't going to lead not to nothing but them martyring themselves even further. Someone is depressed, depressed. This is a narcissist that's in your energy. This is someone that's very close to you very up close and personal, not married, got a girlfriend that's out here pretending to be someone of high honor. Uh, baby, it's a whole lot of energies involved in the situation. But as you, as you analyze, as the universe and your ancestors reveal the truth to you as time goes on, you will put two and two together that when you see these people, when they come to worship, you'll be like, oh, you're the fake woman of high honor. Oh, you're the depressed king of uh, pentacles that's been out here lying and pretending to be wholesome, pretending to be intellectual, pretending to be a sage, a hermit. You ain't none of the above, baby. Now you got to be practical, okay? Then out here coming after a whole queen of cups and press energy because you're too greedy. Mad because a woman does not reciprocate the same feelings you have for them. 
so you've been out here trying to destroy uh, someone okay you are trying to destroy a queen of cups because the feelings are not reciprocated you see that right there and someone is stuck with a queen of cups in the reverse as well baby it's too much it's the duality for me <laughs> it said everything you are in the light working community as a queen of cups in the upright she's the opposite of everything 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 she's not even emotionally available i'm telling you this is someone that plays mental games there could be a king of a uh, uh, wands that's stuck in his head confused all over the place he thought he was going to be able to come in and give someone some type of delusional or illusional explanation about why something went on he was going to come in and be captain safe a whole 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 day not knowing that you know people have been out here doing sneaky stuff family members friends relatives maybe this has been the uh the, the theme for the past three months um in the spiritual community people just gathering together some of these people have been plotting your demises for months for years weeks whatever you can think of these people have been plotting it but everything they've been plotting for you look at them stepping right into it going from the living at the top to dang that's you melissa is that you it's just when they go hiding they don't want you to see them begging on the street no more they said, you know, Melissa used to be all friendly, wanting attention and everything. The attention seeker, she wanted everybody to see her, okay? She wanted everybody to see her Gucci bag, her Christian Dior, everything, right? Louis Vuitton, how much money she has, the Lamborghini she's driving today, the porch she's going to be driving tomorrow. Now, Melissa don't want you to see her. You're like, what, what had happened, Melissa? What had happened? What had happened? Oh, you all thought because you had connections on the inside and they were willing to do anything, sign that document and say that someone was okay with you having what belongs to them, that you were going to get away with it. Oh, because you all have connections in the police department, you just assume you're going to get away with it. Ah, uh, because you are set up this frivolous court case and you're going to take someone to court, try to take them for everything they've got. You just assume that everything was just going to go in your favor right because they're the lord lords of the lands correct okay the universe is about to teach you all a lesson teach you all a lesson and it's going to be coming in piping hot okay piping hot okay oh it's definitely a court case coming up there's a queen of wands that's in some type of legalities and she is afraid as can be okay she may even want to come towards you give you some type of friendship try to act like you and her are friends she may still be trying to befriend someone else behind the scenes so that she can pay them to end you sneak you block you because this is someone that's locked up still calling up i picked up on her yesterday someone is locked up still calling the practitioner to see what is going on in the energy because instead of her being in there and worried about what is going on no 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 you may want to figure out how you're going to come up with the money for their court case she's still out here trying to cause illusions to a man of high honor so that he does not take action to support you advocate for you or give you some type of offer uh, Okay. Even he at this point, he's frustrated. He's like, I don't know what to do. I'm stuck in between a rock and a hard place. These people don't want me moving on, balancing something out. These people keep doing this. They keep doing that. Um, blah, 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 blah. He's just like, I don't want to be part of this anymore. I am very confident uh, that I want uh, to give to this person and be friends with this person, meet with this person. I am going to communicate with them to put this sucker to an end. Okay. I can't do this anymore. This institution is coming to an end. And this is why everybody's fighting behind the scenes. This is why everybody's pissed off at you, even though you didn't do nothing to them. There's too much clarity out here. So all the little cute tricks they're playing out here, trying to delete evidence. Someone is burning evidence behind the scenes. They don't want people to find out. It's a queen of swords out here that's losing her S-H-I-T behind the scenes. A sister don't use so many words to manipulate people behind the scenes. Now that, scenes, now that the truth is out, she can't remember the lies that she told all the manipulations, everything. A sister's out here having an emotional breakdown. <gasps> she had refused to live in a world where that high priestess, that empress, the emperor is living a good life. I said they were worthless. Girl. <laughs> This collaboration between she and this King of Pentacles that's been that's been working really hard behind the scenes, baby. It's over. Mm. It's over. Whether they were in a relationship, friendship, 
uh, collaboration, everything is over. It's over now. And these people don't know what the heck to do with themselves. They said, what's going on? What is going on? I thought we were in control of this situation. I thought we were in control of this person's destiny. Are you listening to yourself? I thought we were in control of this person's self-esteem. Are you listening to yourself? I thought we were in control of this person's mental. We had everything on lockdown. You did. And then the source stepped in and said, oh, yeah, that's real cute. I'm in charge of this situation. I just wanted you to get real comfortable so you could think that you were doing something. Everything you stole, everything you've been doing is about to be exposed. And you're about to owe this person a whole lot of money so that their ancestors, their bloodline, lineage can be restored. So everything you were doing, baby, is about to be multiplied 10 times full. You are burdened. We do not care. Two people will still be meeting, communicating, and having clarity. And you can be upset, upset. Someone may have sent a, a light worker a communication. Maybe you didn't receive it because uh, Madame, Mr., Madame, <laughs> they're out here blocking communications. But everything is still being exposed. Look at your new beginning, girl. Look at your new beginning, brother. Just solidify, approve, sign, seal, and deliver by your ancestors. Uh, judgment of the source saying, yes, 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 yes. It is time. It is time. Baby, it is time. It is time for their new direction. They're trying to block your offers, your options. They don't want you taking in a new path. They want you stuck where you are. So someone is out here losing their mind. That you're about to have a new beginning, new opportunities, new home, new life, new personality, you know, extra, extra vibes, extra, extra sauce, just living your la vita loca while they're going through karma. And someone may want to come towards you with a sad story. They may want to call you, text you, email you. Uh, the number you have dialed is n no longer in service. Please check the number and try again. Yeah, it's the end. It's the end. Baby, they've been... <clears throat> These people have been plotting for a long time. I mean the level of commitment to take other people down, steal what belongs to other people. If only you all took all that energy and invested it in yourselves and your destiny. Lord, the beautiful places you will be. But look at you. Okay? Still out here trying to end some type of communication, block some type of communication. Okay? And they're still going to, baby, the, the communications you are, are blocking is useless. It's not going to do nothing. There's nothing you can do to block what the universe has destined. The universe has destined this. There's nothing you can do. Baby, I keep being told to tell someone there's a man around you mm -hmm, that's watching you on social media, stalking you. Um, this could be a king of pentacles. That acts like he's very practical, very diplomatic. He's not. He's not. This is someone very emotionally imbalanced. Uh, someone is uh, this close to losing it. They may spaz out one of these days very soon. <laughs> A couple of days. <laughs> because, baby, guess what? <laughs> Look at you getting your ace of pentacles. <laughs> Staying strong, minding your business. And having options out here. And the audacity of you to know that you're about to be walking away. And having endless opportunities to blend. <laughs> Plan your future, you recover. <laughs> oh Lord, they said it's a high priestess going through her ending. Girl, you sick out here? What what had happened? Did you get involved with some dark people you shouldn't have? Uh she's living in fear, fear. She's afraid, angry, bitter, mad, whatever she is behind the scenes because her her rituals are not working. You're gonna have to move on, darling. Because whatever rituals you're doing, baby, they're coming right back to you. It's like immediately back to sender. <laughs> Oh, was that for us? Were you sending that to us, the light workers? That's real cute. Return to sender. All your negative energies and intent. Return to sender. Okay, we are returning to returning them to you, baby. Our hearts are light as feathers. My ad is out here. Handing out humble pies, knocking on people's doors. That uh, bum bum bum. She's not even gentle with it anymore. Maya, it's not. She ain't playing. She's on a battleground. Just say, I don't got time to play with you. You heard me knock, didn't you? You heard me knock. Open the door, then. You don't want to open the door. That's okay. I'm gonna bust it open for you. I'm here. <laughs> I'm here. You what you thought you was gonna get away with? Oh, you thought you was gonna steal and they just sneak away. Talking about, I'm just going to go over here. No, 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 no. Bring the ASSR back here. 
bring that ass back here. Okay? We got we got some scores to settle. That's what my app wants you to know. We got scores to settle. How would you like this humble pie? You got options. You got options. Unemployment. <laughs> Poverty. Divorce. <laughs> Sickness. Loss of a loved one. Death. What would you like? You don't want to choose? Uh, 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 uh. That's when the hyperventilation kicks in. He said, calm down. You didn't have all that out of that when you were out here trying to take someone out. You, you were out here happy. Remember when they were giving you those checks and you were taking the checks? You know, someone was coming in to give you friendship and say, hey, I need you to uh, block this person for what's moving in the universe. I think not, but we're going to see how this plays. We want to see how far you're going to take this. Mm-hmm. Now it's a woman in jail, afraid, don't know what's going to happen. Is he talking to her yet? Is he talking to him yet? Is she talking to him yet? Have they connected? Did he give her money? Oh, my God. We got to stop it. Desperate as heck. You, gotta, you need to go heal, girl. You got to go heal. Nobody got time. Because nobody got time for this. Ain't nobody got time for this. Look at them trying to trying to block your manifestation. The universe is out here protecting it. It's like, girl, we got you, boy. We got you. We got you. Uh, someone will still be coming in. These people don't know who's coming in. They think they know who's coming in to give to you or to bless you. But maybe you're out here manifesting your ancestors, the universe, your angels are manifesting a whole new beginning for you that nobody can block. Nobody knows where it's coming from. That's why they're all living in fear. These people got comfortable thinking they were in charge of something. They were in charge of your destiny. They thought they had you living in enough fear and anxiety that you all would be refusing offers out here. Oh, you want to date me? No, I don't want to date you. The last person that I dated was so horrible towards me. I'll never date again. I be yes, girl. You better go out and live your life, sir. Go out and live your life. Okay, go enjoy yourself. Don't be in rush for nothing, but go out and live your life. It's like, uh, I don't know if I should stay at this job here. They treat me poorly. They're always talking down to me, but I'm going to try to make it work out. I'm not going to go look for another job, girl, please. <laughs> she said, where, where the new job at? You better start looking. Look at you about to step into a bond. Is leaving that karmic nonsense behind this, behind you. That's what people do. They try to have you living in fear and anxiety, uncertain of the future. Who's going to do this to me? What's going to, yeah, confused and stuff. But what's going to happen to me if I go there? If I leave from here, I'm going to lose. Who told you you're going to lose everything? You're keeping yourself trapped and bonded with a group of people that don't even give two hits about you. Okay? You got a family out here. Baby, they got have a lot of dreams, a lot of wish fulfillment. Now they got to try to stay calm because they already know what's up ahead of them. It's not just the King of Cups reverse that I'm picking up on that's out here pissed up throwing the temper tantrums and everything. Baby, it's a whole lot. There could be also a family with a King of Cups where he wants to give to somebody and they don't want him giving to you because they say you're not part of the family. You're not like them. They don't like your mindset. You could be like a healer. A lot of them are karmic and toxic as can be. I don't think this is something that has to do with emotions. I think someone is just ethical. That's all it is, but I don't think it has anything to do with emotions. For some of you, it could have to do with emotions with you in this King of Cups that's in the upright. Who knows? Time will figure that out. Time will review itself. Well, there's a king of cups behind the scenes that wants to work with you, give to you, but people don't want him communicating with you. So they're doing a lot behind the scenes to interfere with communications. If you are meant to meet this person, you will meet them in divine timing. Someone is still going to be taking action. So go ahead and do what they got to do. Okay. So, you know what? Source put this on my heart to do this for you. So I'm going to do it for you. If he doesn't, it's not the end of the world. Your, your ancestors right there. The universe, your angels, they're manifesting something new for you because you've been doing the work. So you don't got nothing to worry about. Stay calm. They're still pouring into you. They're going to be balancing this situation out. Someone ain't doing well behind the scenes, baby. They're sick, trapped, knee healing, going through financial, like everything. They're trying to, I don't know what the heck it is they're trying to do, but someone, karma is kicking in real bad. 
karma ain't doing too nice to somebody out here is it uh we told you to walk away you said you wanted to keep going so don't be out here living in fear now okay don't be out here with anxiety locked up and everything still trying to cause blockages and stuff like that to people girl you a clown <laughs> sir you a clown <laughs> right there clown gotta put your nose right there right there right there oh my god someone is depressed they say I can't manipulate her. I was wanting her to see me as her lover, her twin flame, her soulmate. No. <clears throat> Someone thought they were going to come in, woo you, because they got a little bit of cha-ching, cha-ching, and you're going to be out here just a, oh, my gosh, he is so handsome. <laughs> oh, my gosh, he is so diplomatic. He is so awesome. Character on cloud nine. A 10 out of 10 as a person. No, 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 no. This is a shitty. Excuse my French. Ah, this is a shitty person. Going through karma. Okay. They're trying to block someone from doing the right thing. They're trying to block someone from working with you, basically. Some of you, this person may even be in competition with the person that you're supposed to be with or supposed to be working with. They're in a competition with. Someone's very depressed. I don't know why they're depressed. Because they got themselves in the fender bender that they're in. Someone chooses to be emotionally manipulative, okay? Someone appears to be very, you know, of high honor, but no, 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 okay? Th this is someone that just plays with people's emotions, very moody, unstable. One moment they like you, the next moment they don't. The next moment they want to work with you, the next moment they don't. Someone's very moody and unstable, okay? Very, very unstable. So that will un explain why whoever he's with is locked up because they're the same. Because they had to be in some type of trauma binding connection. And that's why they were together. There's something here, here about trauma binding. Both of them are, are emotionally unstable. This was a trauma binding relationship. It was not love. It was just that, oh, you know, I had a hard life. You know, this is how I express love by being a control freak and invading people's privacy and blah, 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 blah. Stalking and following people around, having people watch you and things like that. Or, you know, blocking people from talking to you because that's what they do to each other. She's no different from him. He's no different. They're all the same. They're both the same. This is a trauma bonding relationship. And I don't know what it is that's about to happen to them. But honey, that don't got nothing to do with us. We're in the light working community. We're over here healing. Hopefully they heal someday because that's what we want, to, want for people. Everybody, not just the light workers. But we want the dark people to heal too because everybody deserves to be living a fulfilling life. But whatever these people are going through, it is well deserved. It's not something we feel. So, this is, they, they did this on choice, by choice. Okay. Everything they're going through, they put themselves in there voluntarily. They uh, were out here with endless opportunities, trying to figure out how to end people, take people out, block people. They thought it was a joke at first. Something ain't funny. I'm telling you, something ain't funny no more. It ain't funny no more. They lost their funny bones. They said, oh, that Queen of Cups is not interested. Oh, my gosh. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> This man could be someone that dates multiple women as well. And this is how he's been for a long time. Someone does not realize that, I don't know, I guess age has caught up to them. There's someone in here that's sick as well. Someone's very sick. They're on their last leg. Uh, honey, I don't feel sorry for anyone. That's karmic, being out here trying to destroy other people, limit people's options and opportunities and things like that. Just because you're sick does not mean that we're about to... Uh, be booing with you. No, 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 no. No, that, maybe that's karma you're going through. You take from people, source takes from you. That's how it goes, okay? You take, take, take. Maybe someone is finally choosing to learn. There could be a high-level soulmate that may have fallen from grace before, and now he's finally choosing to learn his lesson and move on with his life. After some type of disappointment, someone may have went back to the past. Or someone is going through some type of loss because it worked with a family to cause you some type of loss. Should it have you put out uh, or have you left out in the cold? Have you lo lose everything? I don't know what the heck these people thought they were doing. But I'm telling you, the most high is out here taking a whack at it. And these people are still out here paying 
for your ending. Maybe even hire an assassin. Whatever this is, they're still out here trying to pay people to take you out. But the universe, baby, is taking care of it. Anyways, i see you next time. Thank you for watching the Ascended Divination Priestess channel. Stay blessed. I'll see you in my next read. Goodbye for now.